Hey y'all, I'm Hunter Daniel. And my name is Brandon Blue, and we are students here at Georgia Southwestern State University. Today, we wanna show y'all our freshman residence hall. So let's go take a look. This is the main lobby of Oaks, and this is one of the many common areas that we have here in this facility. So upstairs, there are two multi-purpose rooms as well as these couches and tables behind us. So in all of these rooms, they play games like the residents will host game nights, movie nights, and really just any interaction they want to have with their fellow residents. We want to ensure that students have all the help they could potentially need while here on campus. On every hallway, there's a residential leader and every building there's a residential staff member. There's also desk assistants that sit at this desk right here throughout the day and into the evening. Now let's check out our showrooms. Make sure you have your student ID because this is how you get in the building and on your hall. So in Oaks, you have two rooming options. You have a shared room and a semi-private. Other than like your personal details and your personal touches, these rooms will come fully furnished and you're about to see what we're talking about. So this is our shared room. As we said, this is one big open room and you will share it with one roommate. A huge plus to our residence halls is we don't have any community bathrooms. So you will have a bathroom in this room and that is will only be shared with your roommate. You can rearrange and bring anything that you feel to make this room your own. As I said, you can rearrange to meet like you and your roommate's needs and just make it your own unique style. This is our uh, semi-private room and with this style you can have a room all to yourself with a little bit of privacy and you'll still have a roommate and you can also bring your little pet fish to keep you company. There's a laundry room on every floor in Oaks. On the first floor, it is located in the lobby, but on the second and third floors, they can be found in the multi-purpose rooms. Once you move in, you will get a laundry card that you will use to pay to use the washer and dryer. You will use this machine to load money onto your card before you use it. The kitchen is located on the third floor and is open to everyone in the building. It's a full kitchen, so all you need to bring is your own cookware and make sure that you clean up after yourself. This is the uh, Oaks Cart Yard. This connects Oaks 1 and Oaks 2, and this is a central meeting place for all freshmen on campus. So this also will hold many events throughout the year. Organizations will host events and campus. One event that is a tradition each year is they'll do like a cookout on move-in day. So there are always tons of volunteers here to help you move in and get settled, and they will all come out here and fix a plate, and all the incoming freshmen will mingle and get to know their classmates. We're so excited for you to be a part of the Hurricane family and to move on campus. Once you've been accepted and housing applications have opened, you'll receive an email with instructions. If you have someone in mind you would like to live with, you can request them as your roommate. Thank you for joining us on today's tour of Oaks. If you have any questions, feel free to call Admissions or Residence Life. And as always, go Canes! <laughs>